Legends, this is Benjamin Young, and today I'm playing the first five minutes of Terraria. I'm going to go with the single player option, and create a character. It fades in and out, I played this earlier, and it fades in and out of the day-night cycle, so I'll try and let it do that. I'm going to just create a random one here, and we'll call her Beth, and go with it. Create the world. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm gonna make a small world. World one, two, three, four. You can name it whatever. Accept. Builds it all. Terraria is nice and small. It's like 64 meg. It's all like a little pixely and great. I'm playing again on a Surface Pro 2, which it runs very nicely. <laughs> and a mouse and keyboard headset. That kind of combination. Sadly, Terraria doesn't use um, a controller. Not sure why. It seems like it'd be great. It's a WASD key layout and uh, then mouse for aiming. And then a whole lot of menuing, as you'll see here in a second. Takes a little bit to build the world the first time, but it should be done shortly. Growing spider caves. Oh dear. Mossification. I haven't read all these. Making cave walls. You see a lot of that. And uh, it's all procedurally generated, so every time it's different, which is cool. I tried it earlier uh, with my son, and we did multiplayer, and that was awesome. If your network holds, it's really great to have more than two people, or more than one person in the world. So here we go with single player. Settling a few more liquids. <laughs> I guess. Here we are. Alright, so this is Beth. And who is this? Scott. I am here to give you advice on what to do next. It is recommended that you talk with me anytime you get stuck. Help! You can use your pickaxe to dig through dirt and your axe to chop down trees. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm not going to read everything he says because that's not what we're here to do. This is the crafting menu, which you can also get to by using escape, which is handy. Uh, most of the time you're going to use this hotbar, which is number keys, and that's an axe. And then you just click and use the mouse to target with, and WASD to move, and stuff falls, like in crafting games. Um, so we're going to harvest some wood here. Looks like there's a cave off to my right. We've got an acorn. Can I do something with the acorn? And I can hit with it. That's cool. All right. Oh, I planted it. Neat. Okay. All right. Here we go. Oh, I have a sword. Is it snowing? It's snowing. All right. It's, okay. There's some rocks. Let's mine with these rocks. I think I'm hitting it. Oh, there we go. Gotta move the mouse around. Target. And apparently it's got a decent range and she can dig behind her. That's a block. Everything turns into these little squares. Okay, so I have some stone and some dirt. The space bar jumps. And that is a what? A mushroom. And it's a mushroom. Doesn't tell me anything else about it. Let's go. What can I craft? Anything? I can craft a wood platform and a workbench. Now, something I learned from earlier is that if you want to build a really great place to live, you should build it right around where you started, which I think is right here, because you'll respawn in that area every time. So I'm going to build a workbench. can be placed, used for basic crafting. Let's see if we can get some crafting in in these five minutes. Hey, workbench! Whack! Oh, nice. All right, we have a door. Let's build one of those. Uh, did I build it? There it goes. I have a door, which I can attack with. Okay. <laughs> I drop it in there. There we go. Alright. Um, a sign. That sounds useful. And a wood wall. Let's build some of that. Ooh, okay, so if you keep clicking, you get more stuff. And we will draw... Uh oh Oh, what's the screen thing? Prepare for battle! Hi, bunny. Don't want to kill you. Oh, ouch. Oh, Gibbs. 
Ouch, ouch. Don't kill me. Ooh, I got a gel. Ooh, and I can make a torch now. Okay, let's make a torch. I really Click. There we go. Ooh, I have a torch. I have three torches. Um, I'm gonna... Should be good in the snow, I guess. Don't want stone up here. All kinds of junk in my hotbar at the moment. I suppose the hotbar is like something at Ryan's, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Here we go. Let's go down in a cave. Oh, we still have a few minutes left. And I'm probably stuck. Try this torch out. Oop, no, that's an axe. Torch! Oh, that's all that's down here. Boring! Oh, now I'm stuck. Okay. Great. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to mine my way out of this problem. When in doubt, dig, I guess. Here we go. That's gonna take a while. Oh, Daniel, no, don't come down here. Or Daniel? No, Scott. Alright, just a couple more minutes. Oh, that slime is doing damage to the penguins and things up there. Fear not, Scott. I will save us. Maybe. Ha! Ah. So yeah, Terraria is a lot of clicking. <laughs> it's super awesome with more people. Um, the thing I like about it is the platformer setup. It actually lends itself to a lot more exploration than you would think, because you go down. Um, Don't Starve is a favorite game of mine, and that's a uh, pretty open world. And... Ah! Okay, we're in the dark. Alright, let's try a torch. Four is my torches. And stick it on the wall, which is a cool feature. Ooh, look at that. There's some other rocks. We might come back down here. Right now, we're building a staircase out of here. Let's do this. Come on, Beth. You can do it. Maybe. Wow, this is tedious and slow. But think of all the dirt blocks I have. Meanwhile, the slimes are wreaking havoc above ground on all the woodland creatures. I must save the woodland creatures. There's not really an objective per se outside of surviving, because it's a surviving and crafting game. Yay, we're out! Hooray! I have a lot of dirt. Can I use my dirt? I have 113 dirt. What can I do with dirt? I can hit with it. Can I? I can place it. That's not really great. Or rather, it's not what I want. And I can't switch to something automatically if I'm holding something else. Hey, grew some grass. Neat, I got it back. Okay, um... What else do we have? I can build more wood walls, I guess. Try and finish off my, my little house. Um, it is very prudent to build a house. Ooh, I'm out. Um, as I found playing earlier with my son, uh, at night more than slimes come out. Oh, lag. What happened? Um, so yeah, you want to be prepared for that. So building a shelter right away is a great idea. But I think we're well past our five minutes. So, oh, with the death of the bunny, I'm going to stop there. Thank you very much. Have fun playing Terraria.